All right, y'all, so I have to do a quick update on my Traxxas C Revo 1.0 Mamba Monster 2200 KV electric, electric brushless truggy, and I believe it's a four pole. I just didn't want to say four pole just in case. But um, now that I got the update done, we're ready to go. Got the blue light at the back of the remote. I got the Bluetooth module for it, but I don't have all the telemetry sensors for speed. I don't need them anyways to save some money. I got the Sky RC, of course. As you can tell, I've mounted on the rear wing of all my Erevos. Well, all my Erevos, as in my three Erevos, two minis and this one. This is the 1 8th Erevo with the SRC Road Crushers. They're made by a company called Sweep Racing. And they're the on-road version, belted, of course, belted wheels. And the old PB is 80.7, so I'm going to try to break that today with like 81 or, or faster, you know, hopefully up in the early to mid 80s. And I'll see one of my foot up, stop remote CQI, which, uh, which was a uh, replacement. This isn't the original one I came up with, but the other one was also CQI, so. Anyways, we're going to get this going because I dropped the other remote. But we're going to get this going. Everything is zeroed out, guys. Okay, I know that uh, you don't believe me, but it's zeroed out. And uh, I'm going to be doing another run with another set of batteries. I got the Yoon Power 5200 milliamp, 11.1 volt, 3S50C batteries in here, the soft packs. And I got the HRB racing in the car. And those are three self core soft packs as well, but 60C with 120C burst, all right? I don't know what the burst is on these ones. But anyways, you guys noticed the uh, Traxxas Rustler VXL two-wheel drive run that I did earlier. I crashed it, parachute, as you can tell. I also didn't know this, but I popped the foam in, uh, in one of the rear Anaconda wheels. I guess it's because of the heat. But anyways, let's get this going. This vehicle's still geared the same. Mod 1, 25 pinion, which is a Robinson Racing 25 tooth aluminum pinion, or uh, stainless steel, I believe. I'm not exactly sure one of the two, but it's a durable pinion, expensive and a 36 tooth uh, hot racing spur gear, also mod one. So 2536 mod one gearing, let's get this run going. All right, suck that I had to update it, but it is what it is. I haven't run this truck in a while, or truggy. This one eight scale truggy, I don't like calling it one ten because it's not. All right, and we're gonna get this run going in a second. Hopefully it doesn't fall, I hope not. Expensive phone, you know, I don't want to damage my expensive iPhone. iPhone costs more than this Truggy, so. All right guys, let's do it.
it's me or something doesn't sound right in the wheels. I'm not sure, but... Give me a second, folks. Now, I've heard that sound before, but I just don't want to take the risk. Okay, let's see what that speed was. I don't even know what it was. I'd say 75 to 78 miles per hour. Heck, it could be faster than what I'm claiming, but I don't know. I don't want to be wrong. <laughs> Don't want to jinx myself, you know? I'm sure we're still recording. Okay, let's see what that was, people. Good people of YouTube, my loyal subscribers who love GBT. Holla holla at your boy. Okay, like I said, so peak speed in miles per hour, it says 76 miles per hour, 76. We're gonna try to do more than that though on these batteries. These are the 50 Cs. I know with the 60 C HRB racings, I did that 80.7 miles per hour, which is the current PB, my current personal best on 6L. This is also a 6L run right now. So 76 miles per hour, I'm gonna show you guys. I don't know if you can see that, but 76 miles per hour, okay? But I actually did a little bit faster than 76 because in kilometers per hour, it's a little bit more accurate. So we actually went faster than that, uh, hopefully, but <laughs> more than likely we did. We as in, you know, me, but uh, okay. So 124 kilometers per hour. So 124 kph, do the math yourselves on your phones, on your tablets, okay? You can do the math yourselves. 124 kph. All right. Let me put the rest of the stuff away in my other pocket so you guys can see better. Okay. All right, so, so far, 76 point something, maybe even 77. Like I said, I said we were gonna get up in the mid 70s and well, when I, pray, when I uh, make predictions, you know, I'm like Mr. Mac himself, Conor McGregor, you know what I mean? Or Mystic Mac, Mystic Mac, you know, I'm like Mystic Mac himself. I make these predictions, you know what I'm saying? So 124 kilometers per hour, Shout out to Conor McGregor, even though I don't really like him all too much. All righty. Got the Yeah Racing heat sink and motor fan combo. Twin motor fans. And it's extremely hot. Oh my God, it's hot. Wow. All right. We're going to do another run shortly. So to say, to say video space, guys, I think... Uh, I think I'm gonna close out this video on this uh, on the C Revo run, and I'm gonna make another video with the 60C lipos. Okay, once again, I'm running the Yum Power 50C ones in here. Okay, two three S's equals out to six S. And other than that, folks, I don't know what else to say. I mean, it sounded kind of funny. I heard this rattling sound. It sounded like I, you know, I popped my phones out or something. But I think that's normal with SRCs. I've I've actually heard that sound before. I'm quite familiar with it. So, you know, it's just me getting paranoid. I don't want to take the risk of damaging a $680 RC car, $675, but still. So, Mod 1 gearing once again, 2536. Your boy GBT is out. Until the next video. All right. Peace, y'all.